Hello, Libra. Welcome to your next 48 hour reading. Let's see what's coming through for you. All right. What is coming through for Libra? We also have the last cause, everybody. Last call for your full moon reading. Um, guided by the energy of the full moon eclipse. Um, if you check the description bar, you'll see a link if you're interested where you can go ahead and book your reading. Last call for those. Um, the last day to purchase those readings will be tomorrow, okay? All right. Let's see what's coming through for you. First, let's see how Libra is showing up. Please only take what resonates, leave what does not. If you find something here that resonates, make sure you give this reading a big thumbs up. Greatly appreciate it. Let's see what is coming through for Libra. Okay, you have the Four of Swords. Choices, 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 decisions. I'm also here, I don't know what to do. So I feel like you could be thinking about something where you don't know what to do. You don't know which option to take. You don't know which door to go through. You don't know which move to make. So it's like choices. <clears throat> You're on the brink of starting a whole new beginning. You're on the brink of starting something that can completely change your life. Like completely. It's like you're starting something new. So this anxiety kind of comes with the territories. So whatever it is that you're starting, whatever it is that you're going to be working on, something, some type of anxiety comes with it. It's like if you were told you, you know, you hit the lottery or some really, really good news or whatever. That anxiety comes with it. It's like it comes with the territory. Yeah, and then speaking of lottery, we see fish. So there's a lot of riches, a lot of money. I feel like you got a lot. You could be handling a lot of things or making a lot of moves. It's almost like you got so many options. This could be some type of good news when it comes to some family drama or a family problem or a problem, a personal problem you were having. Something, something helps a personal problem. You resolve a personal problem, but you're anxious right now. It just looks like you got a lot of um, choices. All right, you have save more, spend less. So this has a lot to do with money. So it looks like you're going to have some type of money or some type of energy. Um, Spirit is telling you to save more of this money than you spend. So put some of this money away for you. Um, somebody could possibly be getting a new car. But somebody is real, real pressed over what they call it. They don't want nobody to eat in their car. They don't want you to touch it. Like if you touch their car, they might come out, might pull a microfiber cloth out of nowhere and just start <laughs> Yeah, I dated one of those. So they are they are very, very real. Like want people touching their car. You may be like that in this new car, this new car that you get. Yeah, it look, looks like you're getting paid for doing something that you love to do. Like, so whatever you love to do. You could be getting a lot of energy and you might not know what to do with all that energy. It's something good that's coming to you. But you're on the brink of starting a whole like. You could be going through some type of awakening where you're feeling more positive, right? Oh, these are in the reverse. I'm oh, sorry. I have my deck upside down. I just have to say, hold on now. <clears throat> you got wish fulfillment coming out. So this is good news. I feel like if you were expecting something not to go good, this is like, there's a need for you to go and visit the Lululand real quick. And just have that mindset like everything's all good. <laughs> I mean, we do it in relationships all the time. Like just go into the Lululand, say, hey, it's me again. 
and live in la la land and everything's all good i was about to say if you're not thinking positive you definitely need to start thinking positive because there's some type of anxiety that comes with the territory but it's like you having good stress Let's see. This is good stress. All right, yeah, we got the Ace of Pentacles. All right, so you'll be feeling better, okay? You'll definitely be feeling better. You'll be feeling real optimistic. you just be feeling taken care of, like something is, is going in your favor. There's a need for you to protect your peace or maybe protecting your boundaries or um, standing up for what you believe in. It definitely pays off. It brings you this wish fulfillment. Again, you'll be celebrating. Also, you could be spending time with friends. The Queen of Pentacles is about like protecting the people that she loves, nurturing the people that she loves. Like she don't play about the people that she loves. Okay, so very, very family oriented or very, very like friend, you know, being with your lover. It's like you're very, very protective over what you love, who you love right now. You can also have some new opportunity where you can protect the people that you love. You can take care of the people that you love. It's just saying, like, don't go crazy. Because save more than you spend, which means, like, with the little that you spend, you'll be able to protect a lot of people or take care of a lot of people. You might donate to a lot of people. It's like you're in this giving spirit, okay? Okay. Um, you might feel like you want to bless somebody. You got the book. There is a, there's some type of really, really good news that's coming towards you. There's really, really good news that's coming towards you. And you have the writer coming out, bringing good news. So some good news coming in 48 hours. What else is coming through? All right, we got fast moving drama and chaos. My dog is just, don't mind Sage right now, okay? Because she is just doing too much. <laughs> She's just barking. She want to talk right now. <clears throat> I'm, some of you guys, there's a place that you're supposed to be, okay? So you're supposed to be seated at a table. But when you get to the table, there may also be an enemy there too. And you may think just because you see an enemy somewhere, you may think, oh, I'm not supposed to be here because wherever I'm supposed to be, you may have this idea like there, it, I shouldn't be around this person or whatever. But remember, the table is prepared in the presence of your enemy. So if you see somebody or there could be someone that could be causing chaos or someone that you're um, showing them you're being cold to, or you may need to be a little cold. You may need to turn, turn your back on a person, like look the other way. Don't be confused just because you go into a room and you see a person you don't like there. Like, oh, nah, mm -mm. you're supposed to be there says control your feelings leave it's giving it's given leave some feelings at the door or leave the feelings at home or leave the emotions at home um or leave something at home like it's some good news it's some really good news yeah you got the ace of swords you're supposed to not only are you supposed to be here but you're getting crowned or you're getting something. This is success for you. It comes out of the blue. And you're confused because you may see an enemy there. You may see somebody who you don't like. Or maybe you had an idea that it's going to happen another way. Let me go through one more. What else is coming out for it? Okay. All right. So the biggest energy here.
There's a person, a manipulator. Um, the biggest energy for some of you guys, you could have been dealing with somebody who could have could be a manipulator. It's something about them just stops. Like it's something that a manipulator or a narcissist thought they were going to be doing within the next 48 hours, and it just completely stopped. Like you got so much protection over you. Like this completely stopped. It delays something that this person. Oh, look what's hiding. The page of okay, so this was. So that's what that person was going to do. So you have the page of swords in reverse. Somebody was going to spread some rumor and manipulate a bunch of people or manipulate you through rumors, lies, gossip. Could be this fast moving drama or something like that. Something completely stops. You have the ship coming in. Some, a ship came in and it completely stopped. All of a sudden, some type of ship came in. All of a sudden, some type of mes um, message comes in. It's like in a nick of time, some good news comes in. This is also from an unsuspected enemy. Like you're not suspecting this person to be an enemy. But they're a narcissist. The King of Cups is woo, with the Page of Swords behind it. You're unsure of how you feel about this. This is something you need to say yes to. Somebody could have been spreading some type of Roman. It's like, then all of a sudden the ships come in. Yeah, you do have the enemy here. This could be, um, I'm getting like somebody was talking about you or somebody was spreading rumors about you and that stops, completely stops. And it allows some, I don't, not it allows, but there's a ship that moves through. You could be like, oh, I'm not, why did this happen? This person doesn't like me or we don't like this person or we have history or, you know, I thought this person was trying to make it hard for me or something like that. You'll be surprised. We do have the high priestess energy. Oh, this is spiritual. It's a lot of things that's happening beneath the surface. Also, you don't know that you're in this new level. You don't know that you've leveled up to a whole nother level, a whole new chapter. Or you have this different energy about yourself. Yeah, there's a message that's coming to you. Yeah, something completely stops. Something works in your favor. It's like somebody was going to do something crazy or say something crazy or start a crazy ass rumor. But it just completely stops. Maybe they stop because they see these riches and all these things coming in something you're going to be surprised how just the way a person feels about you just completely changes like you're like i thought you didn't like me at all but they stop completely you can see beneath the wet veil you know the truth but maybe they feel like they can't they can't do anything maybe they feel like can't beat them join them because something is coming to you Really, really fast. Like if you're feeling anxious, it's a reason why you feel anxious. All right, I'm gonna leave it right here. I hope this reading resonates. If it does, make sure you give this reading a big thumbs up. Make sure you guys are subscribed. I love you guys and I will see you in the next video.